Uh, greetings and welcome, fellow doctors, to another episode of Let's Play Two Point Hospital. All right, let's keep on going. Let's make this the best darn hospital this world has ever seen. And failing that, just curing people. Because that's what we're here to do. I mean, getting to the one star isn't particularly hard, although getting the hospital value up will depend a lot on being able to make profit. Which we're currently not quite able to do because, well, we still need to discover cubism. Although that shouldn't take too long because I believe your diagnosis is probably, you know, close-ish. Difficult to tell until you get into the GP's office. Also, what's the queue like? It's four people. Um, well, let's get you to uh, trained. Still, overall, we're not doing too badly. Today's sponsor is Rent an Eel. Rent an Eel for all of your short term eel based needs. This is Two Point Radio. Nice, we have Cubism. So now it's the time for the recovery room to get activated. Ah, oh, he died. You know, I figured dying from cubism is probably a lot more painful than that makes it look. Alright, let's get the next GP's office in place before I run out of money again. Although admittedly that's much less likely now that I have actually got my cubism in place. Although I do want the, uh, I do want the, what was it, the, um, the injection room, because that's probably still most likely the next batch of diseases coming in. And we may still need a few more nurses. Ooh, epidemic. It's the Jokers, Jokers Ripple. Ah, pam. I hate this one. 
essentially it makes people start flexing and running around. Now, when they're running around, you can easily enough detect them, but a lot of the time they're just sitting. So that makes it difficult to uh, really see. Yeah, when they're running around like this, that's most likely... Yeah, that's a si clear sign that they are infected, so... Mime Crisis, all right, well... All right, you two are also clearly infected. So there's still two remaining. Oh, there you are. Hygiene bad, it could be worse. Mm. Yeah, cacti don't really do much for decor or freshness. Star visit. Doctor needed in psychiatry. VIP arriving. Please prioritize their amusement over patient well being. Yeah, the queue is still fine. Although I may have to squeeze in another. GP's office. Nurse needed in general diagnosis. Mm. Ego, right? Yay! First cure. All right, now we're on track. Training course completed. Strap on your face masks because we're getting reports of a new epidemic. I wouldn't worry too much, though. Those fabulous men and women running the county's hospitals are sure to find a cure soon enough. And if they don't, there's still music like this to listen to. Right. Nope. Right. 
general practice. Is there anyone a doc uh, um you and you'll teach them. Cubism emergency, all right. Cubism are arriving. Now I'm nowhere near ready to handle that, but I'm fine with them coming. All right. Well, in the meantime, let's start setting up our more sophisticated uh, diagnosis machines. This is really one of those weird buildings because of this little extension area up here. There's really nothing you can do with this. I mean, at, no, even not that because that's, uh, yeah, even the most basic rooms is uh, at least three size, except for maybe the uh, the staff room, but you don't want to make the staff room that small anyway, so I usually just put a fountain in there. I mean, I say usually, I've only really done this once before, so... Right. Well, we're doing quite well. That delightful Jasmine Odyssey isn't just a pop song. Which means I can just play that alone and not worry about it anymore. Rock bottom, alright, we have got our injection room, so that's definitely good, although I should probably on singing a song or two, even when the patients begged her not to. What an Just set up some benches over here. And I may need a nurse that can handle that. to the edge of having to build another GP's office and I need to start the divvying up the jobs properly because I don't want my doctors going places where they don't need to be now as for hospital attractiveness uh, as I said I usually put in a fountain or something do I have the fountain unlocked? Well, I don't see it in here, so decorative. Yeah, let's put in a fountain. Fountains are a good way to get massive bits of attractiveness in your hospital. Make it an indoor fountain, because it won't block up the area too much. 
and beyond that, I just basically just need to improve the, uh, the looks of the place a bit. Some meaningless trophies, but definitely do. Let's also put a toilet over here because we don't want that going wrong. Alright, I definitely need another HGP's office. Today, a group of backpackers have been airlifted out of Tumble Ridge after spending a week wandering the woods, then another week stranded on the edge of a cliff. It seems nobody broke anything or tried to eat anybody else. So that counts as a successful trip in my book. Earthquake warning, staff should secure patients before securing themselves. Nope. Well, that was to be expected, really, but we've got a lot of cubes and patients anyway, so we should be speeding along this uh, objective quite quickly now. And then the hard part begins, really. So then you have to start expanding this hospital in this weird setup. And that's gonna take some time. We should get another psychiatrist. Let's clear the deck. Nice. Fracture ward. All right. We can do that. Let's make it one more row bigger. Right, and I should probably really put in a toilet over here. Yeah. 
All right, so far so good. But that'll do for this episode. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.